because you're trying to be perfect. And I know Kate Klubnik is a perfectionist, but right there, take about five yards off it, give him some more air, and you got a touchdown. Phil Mappa. Klubnik and hotline bling. Listen, if you need a play, call Drake May. He's got to make a lot of them today. Here's Mappa. Right up the gut. He is tough to bring down. Gets a push, and finally, forward progress stuff at the nine yard. When you talk about Phil Mappa. I mean, you're talking about a dude that's 6'1", 230 pounds, and he carries his weight with him. Look at his yards per carries over the year, gone up every single season. Way to stay on it and continue to hustle down the football field and make a game-changing play. And off Mappa to start this drop. Two runs by Phil Mappa, and then all of a sudden, Kate Klubnik now gets in rhythm using the RPOs to his advantage. And they will snap it one more time before the end of the quarter, and Mappa is lassoed down. Coordinator Garrett Riley said that Tyler Brown is their most dynamic receiver, and we saw that last week with the one handed OBJ like catch. Back to Mappa, who almost busted it. He's got six yards, but an ankle tackle by Stick Lane saved the touchdown. There was no one between Mappa and the end zone. Yeah, I mean, you could drive a truck through the hole that he just ran through off the field with the shoulder. Mappa in the red zone. Jitterbugs and Pratt crawls down to the seven yard line. Jitterbug, I like that. Watch him when he comes out of the backfield. It's that jump cut that you have. And likes to use the quarterback run. It's where all coordinators who have a quarterback who can be a dual threat like to utilize. Mappa on the 11th play of the drive comes up short. And came up short as well. Amari Gaynor made the stop. Now it'll be fourth down. And it's Amari Gaynor. Was handed the ball against Notre Dame 36 times, 186 yards. He tied a Clemson record for most rushing attempts in a single game, Shipley was out with a concussion, and he basically became like Walter Payton or Earl Campbell, Tony Dorsett. It was a flashback to the old days of a, of a true workhorse running back. Yeah. Came out, trying to get to the sideline, he picks up eight. But the Tigers go quickly. Another blitz coming. Another check down. First down. Out of bounds. He's back there. Maybe the band in the corner and all that blue made him like blend in a little bit. But Cade must be living right, and those prayers he said before the game are working. Mappa with a stiff up. Out of bounds at about the 10 yard, even if it's not really violent contact. Exactly. It's a tough call, though. It's a, and it's a tough call. ask of Cedric Gray there to not try and make a play. Second and five from the nine after the timeout. Clubman, swing pass, Mappa spins out of bounds. Chapman with a little shoulder action to the face. I don't think it was done on purpose, so I think they're going to let this one roll. Mafa gets a bit of a shove from the offensive line. Trying to throw a ball in the tight coverage. Well, today you're seeing him use his legs effectively. Mafa spins. And the heels rally and drive him down. And down. Yeah, seems like they're going to hand it to Phil Mafa and allow him to go barrel full for a first down. They're going to go Wildcat and snap it directly to Mafa. He tries the right hand. job right there. Phil Moffa getting a little creative with the play call. Motioning K. Klubnik out and allowing Phil Moffa to do what he does best. So yeah, you see this vacant spot right here? Well, that's what K. Klubnik was. They ran him out and then they allowed Phil Moffa to get downhill and break it outside. When you get this man in a one-on-one -on -one situation, there is not a player in the country that wants to tackle. And right there, he breaks the tackle on Power Eccles, right at the line of scrimmage, going for the legs. And he said, young man, I run through the arm tackles. Let's get to business. In three high school seasons, Phil Moffa gained about 2,500 yards. He was the Gatorade Player of the Year in Texas back in high school. He'll give to Moffa here. 
And he'll a few years than he has since 2014. Hoffa gets the drive started with a push and grinds out about four yards to the 12-yard line. And that is undefeated, now 124 and one when they have a 10-plus point lead. Entering the fourth quarter, back to the ground. Mappa, very close to a first down. And moments ago, Chris Bunny spoke with Davos Witt. Off the middle with Mappa. Not a happy bunch of Tiger fans down there. So now North Carolina's defense has to get a stop. And they drive Mappa back on first down. After a game. Best play right here on third and fourth. Slow mesh handoff to Mappa, and there is the stop. Good today, but Clemson just happened to be that much better. Mappa up the middle. Has this been from Cade Klubnik? Minimized his mistakes and made plays all throughout the game. Here and certainly before he leaves here, if he continues to mature in the way that he showed tonight. Mappa down to the five yard line. Mappa running with Mappa. 